Hello again, thanks for tuning in and I'm your host Adnan from iMentor Cloud and again this is one of the scores which uh, comes from the question which I have been asked many many times hey you know I'm not in IT and how do I start my career in IT how do I start my career in cloud right so usually um, I tell um, uh, talk about Microsoft Azure 900 exam which is fundamentals which is designed for people who are not IT so people coming from different background and want to have um, some taste of cloud so it could be an accountant could be a sales and you want to have taste of cloud what are type of cloud and how does it work so from Microsoft you can go with Azure 900 um, uh, if I have recorded a video I'll put the link if not then you can check some other videos around that on my YouTube channel and same does apply to um, Amazon associate which they have their offering and their concept of um, uh, cloud uh, fundamental basic knowledge so basically uh, they cover some general general uh, background of cloud and then it's specific to their product and services and same thing there's a course from Microsoft on the digital transformation of business side is Microsoft 365 fundamentals I will give you the high level overview and offering of why should you use Microsoft 365 how it's gonna help you your business and all that so you don't really have to be technical that's a good sign and if you are coming from non IT and you want to pursue your IT you want to see that so those would be your starting point but uh, again what if there is something non vendor and there we go with this cloud essential from Comtia which is a non uh, specific to a vendor and internationally recognized vendor neutral and a standalone field demonstrated not just the IT specialist and uh, you know uh, it will just add value when you're looking for your career so, so we're not gonna go to the detail in the exam it's up to you you're an optional but I'm focused here more on a structure slavers what you gonna learn in this uh, uh, for example this is not exam but again if you uh, wanna be or want to learn something related to the cloud non vendor uh, what you will learn so let's take a look and if you look at the job roles as I told you before sales and marketing and if you get a job as a sales and marketing for a company which sells cloud that is where it's going to help if you're a business analyst and working on the cloud related project then you are on a team with this project so with acronym and uh, and the language is being spoken for different cloud models so you will have understanding what is being discussed and uh, talk and uh, during the project so this is important uh, of course you're not looking for a very technical career as a cloud engineer and all that it could be your starting point but that's uh, not for you because you have to do and uh, learn and earn more skills and more certification but that's being said is specifically designed for people who are non IT and looking for sales and marketing job project management job so that's why this course is important and I would highly recommend people starting their career in IT and cloud is a must-have in my opinion um, so cloud concept basically here we're gonna see around some of the cloud concept what are the how does it cloud work I mean what are the different service model delivery model and um, understand shared responsibility model and what are the concepts around elasticity and scalability what is the virtualization right around those um, the topics are covered in this and then also there is some high level uh, understanding around the networking what is automation how does what is self-service how does it work you know those kind of what is the cloud storage basically you know so how does the data integration and, and how the cloud is secure so those are the areas um, uh, you need to be focusing on this exam and which will give you a very good idea and as I told you before are you going to learn about different type of uh, deployment which is SaaS, PaaS and IaaS uh, software as a service, platform as a service, infrastructure as a service are the different deployment model so when you're a project or something like that so you need to understand all these different uh, deployment and delivery model which is you're going to learn 
uh, in this course in this slavers basically that's what is important and when it comes to cloud you putting the data in the cloud and this piece is always very important every company is concerned about risk and there are some regulatory requirement for uh, like you have to be compliant and you have to have security control when you're putting the data in the cloud so how can you manage that right so you need to know uh, on a very high level that if you are uh, on a project so you need to evaluate the risk of that project based on the type of the data is a customer data what kind of data is going to be put in the cloud uh, and what could be the implication uh, like so example you cannot put your personal identification data for example or patients data in the cloud for example if it's not HIPAA compliant and if you put there some regular data what are the security controls like multi-factor authentication is one of them you can find some details on my YouTube channel if you're watching so I put some videos there so that's in a nutshell is there so uh, I would highly recommend um, uh, this course um, you may not need to do certification as I told you you have three or different uh, you could do uh, this cloud essential at the same time you have Azure fundamentals and at the same time you have Amazon AWS uh, associate so this is they are pretty much more or less the same those two are vendor specific and this is a vendor neutral um, and then if you want to go more on a business productivity suit which is Microsoft 365 fundamentals so that's being said I'll be putting more videos or by the time the video recorded uh, already for Azure fundamentals is recorded on my channel you can go and learn the 40 minutes lecture AWS associate I'll be putting so I'll put the link after the recording and Microsoft 365 fundamentals I will be also uploading a video so if you have any question let me know topics you want to hear and um, uh, future videos can help you also directly as I told you before this course could be somebody in this area of sales marketing project management coming from accounting background non IT uh, so that's where it's going to help so that's it for now. I'll be putting more video. Thanks for watching. Bye.